How's it going guys, Mike here, and today I thought we'd try out some Dark Souls 3. It's a game I've owned for a while, but I've never actually really played before. Um, I'm very much more of a Bloodborne player. Uh, I've never been able to get into Dark Souls very much. It's a, a lot slower paced game. Um, but yeah, you guys seem to be enjoying the, uh, the Soulsborne-esque videos on the channel lately, so I thought I'd give Dark Souls 3 a chance. Um, we are playing on the PS5, so some glorious glorious 60 frames per second we'll be getting which will be new for me i'm so used to crappy 30 frames of club on uh but yeah we'll start a new game i have like i say i've played a little bit before just to just to get a yes, taste indeed. but uh yeah right what are we gonna do then we've got a i'm probably just gonna end up with nikes it's just nice and basic like me just basic as hell saying that warrior looks kind of cool the axe kind of reminds me of the one from bloodborne uh, Herald, Thief, Assassin, Pilot, let's just be boring. I'm gonna go with Knight, I'm boring. Uh, Burial Gift, oh that's cool. So you can start off with something. I did play um, Dark Souls 1 a little bit and did about three or four bosses in that and I picked the uh, I picked the key and God was that a mistake so I just ended up in high level areas I wasn't supposed to access so early. Um, I mean, the fire gem sounds kind of cool. I get to, what, transform my weapons into a fire weapon? I don't know. Let's take fire gem. I kind of like the sound of it. Looks cool. Uh, face presets. Uh, oh, we can be like... Ah, oh, the great swamp outcast is a beautiful face. Let's go for that. Build, of course, we're going to go... Uh, does it make a difference? Let's go a very, very burly. Or maybe a small, maybe a fat head. I don't know. Let's go very burly. We like them thick around here. Oh, look at that's glorious. Nice and round. Hopefully it doesn't affect me. Like it gives me a bigger hitbox. I'm just gonna get dunked on. But um, we'll see. Change my voice. Can I sample? Mm. Okay. Do a remix. Okay. I quite like that one. We'll go for that. Body hair, yeah, give me that thick, thick body hair. This is the ideal male body, you're just too ashamed to admit it. Oh, oh, it's getting beautiful. Oh, okay, that's like a radioactive green, I don't know about that. That'd do, not like a... Well, it's quite a Shrek green, I'd say. Just... <laughs> what has happened? How have we strayed so far from God? What do we go for here? Oh, yeah, the bob cut. I think that's that really suits him there. Beard. I think he could deal with a beard to thicken that jawline or a nice mustache. Oh, just that's that's beautiful. <laughs> Cosmetics. Tone around the eye. Let's get some darker eyes, shall we? <laughs> He's not slept in a while, so um, give him some nice eyeliner, some eye shadow, you know, a bit of makeup, just to really emphasize. <laughs> tattoo. Let's give him a cool tattoo. There we go. Now, now he's a real tough nut, he, you know, you want to walk, walk into this guy in a dark alley, would you? Not with that tattoo and that that menacing menacing haircut. <laughs> I'm from the earth, he is born. The Omega Chad rises. Here we go. I kind of... Do I need this helmet? Does it actually give me... Oh, it actually gives me durability. I'm probably going to need that at the start of this game because I'm, I'm no expert. So, uh, what we got? We got a shield. Not used to that. Uh, oh, we've already got our first enemy. Come on, then. Come on, then. Oh, they, they die in one hit. Okay, fair enough. So, I don't know what's, like better in this game because Bloodborne obviously I'm, I'm so used to like spam dodging but 
This seems a little slower. I don't know if the shield's any good in this game or not. Surely they wouldn't just give me a shield if it was no use, but... I'm probably going to avoid using the shield for a little bit. This guy's having an existential crisis over here. Ashen Estus Fly. I think that's for magic, isn't it? Kia! You guys are just absolute pussies. Can't do anything. Turn back. You know we don't do that here. You know we don't do that here. We don't turn around from a from a challenge. You're kind of big. I'm not gonna lie. I sneak around you, maybe? I'm just gonna grab what's over there, okay? Don't mind me. I think he spied me. <laughs> oh! Okay. Oh, we took our first bit of damage. This guy likes his ice moves, doesn't he? Whoa! I can't tell when he's going to attack sometimes. It's kind of hard to judge. Oh, don't bite me, please. Let's pop an Estus Fly. I'm scared if he hits me one more, I'm just gonna... Ah! Oh, the roly-poly attack again. I'm already out of stamina. Oh, no. Just gotta... Just read him like an absolute book. He keeps rolling at me all the time. Don't bite me, please. I'm actually amazed how well we're doing against this guy. He just keeps doing that roly poly, getting nowhere closer to me. Is that the best this game has got? He didn't even land a hit on me. I was going to say Titanite. <laughs> Is it Titanite? Titanite, maybe. I don't know if that's any good, but... Come on, Dark Souls. If that's the best you've got, then this is going to be easier than Bloodborne. You know? I suppose that thing was like a sub-boss. It wasn't a real boss, but still. Is there anything else I can find around here? Hi. Has he seen me? I think he knows I'm here. Never mind. But yeah, if that sub-boss was anything to go by, this, this is going to be a walk in the park. Easy peasy. Hey, that, that view's kind of nice, though. I don't know, as much as I love Bloodborne, I think this game, I don't know if I'm being biased because I'm playing this on the PS5 and it has been upgraded. This is a really pretty game. I'm just so used to, like, the dark, darkness of Bloodborne, you know, and you don't really see a lot. Like, y Yarnum and all that's kind of pretty and all that, but... I don't know. Dark Souls so far is really good looking. So that's how I get my stuff back. I'm kind of scared someone's going to push me off this cliff if I stand around here too long. Oh, there's another guy having a, having a crisis over there. I'll, um, I'll go give him a hand. Am I going to take too much damage if I just fall down here? Oh, I didn't take any. Oh, okay. You've already done more damage to me than that semi-boss did. Wah! Now, these, these enemies kind of low-key kind of hard. I'm already out of stamina. I keep 
running out of stamina so quickly. These guys are... I think the general enemy is a bit harder than what you find in Bloodborne. I need to stop comparing this game to Bloodborne. I kind of want what's over there. Pressure L3 well. Oh, okay. This is going to take a few tries. Oh, you sneaky devil. Okay, you guys are ganging up on me now. It's not cool. That looks a bit menacing. I don't think I'm going to go over there yet. I think I might want to get some uh, flasks back first. To be honest, there's still a lot to discover around here. Oh, wow. Shields are actually good for the enemy in this game. Not so much for me. Firebombs. I'm probably going to need them. And that kind of looked like a boss. I'll stick them on now. Uh, I don't think I need this thing. I don't use magic. Let's put them on. Yeah, let's get our Estus back. Only three Estus. I don't, that doesn't feel like a lot. I don't know, maybe I'm just being a pussy. You sneaky devil, you got me last time. There we go. Ah, you guys ain't nothing. Yeah, this is definitely a boss. Is he gonna... Is he gonna get up? As soon as I get over there. No? Feels like a trap, I'm not gonna lie. Yeah, he's definitely got... He's got something going on there. Okay. Let's give it a go. Can I do damage to him, like, from the start? Like... Oh, that did. I actually did damage to it. Whoa, you come quick. Okay, this guy's... He's got his, he's got his shit together, I'm not going to lie. Do you like fire? Oh, that's an Estus. I didn't mean to do that. So I'm, I'm one Estus flash down already. Do you like fire bombs? Not kind of a long reach, that scares me. Oh wow, um, that's new. Got a big snake coming out of his head. Whoa. <laughs> okay, you're getting kind of close, scaring me a bit, my dude. Oh wow, you're really easy. You're stupidly easy. I suppose I cheated with those fire bombs a bit, but hmm. Well, I guess that's the first boss of Dark Souls done. Um, yeah, not doing too bad. You guys are gonna probably like think I'm a liar, saying you know he's pretty probably like an absolute pro of Dark Souls. I don't play Dark Souls. I've played and finished Bloodborne, so I'm you know. Not a complete novice to like Soulsborne games. I have played a little bit of Dark Souls One. Never finished it though. Never got even close. I got stuck on those uh, those gargoyles, which is still kind of early in the game, I know. But you know, I'm not a complete novice. But this doesn't feel too bad so far. I think some of the the normal enemies seem a bit more stronger than what I'm used to in, in Bloodborne. But I don't know. The bosses don't seem too bad so far. But that's just because. Once you fought one boss in Dark Souls, you kind of you kind of get used to the patterns of like dodging into attacks and stuff like that. It sounds like really, you know, counterintuitive by jumping in towards an attack to dodge it. But once you kind of learn that in Bloodborne and stuff, that's, that's kind of how you play and sticking close to the bosses. And it just seems the same in this game. So it's probably why it didn't seem too bad. Plus, if he's a first boss, it's kind of like Cleric Beast was never that bad. Once you get to know how to fight them. Yeah, I don't like these shields so far. And I seem to run out of stamina really quickly in this game compared to Bloodborne. I'm probably just not so used to managing it. Yeah, 
Anything cool around here? No? I keep going around. Oh. I think definitely dove through one of them stones. It scared the hell out of me. What have we got here? An ember. See, this is another thing I'm going to have to learn. We're going to get to a point where I'm going to get really stuck just because I don't know what half these items do. Hey, is this the Firelink Shrine? It is the Firelink Shrine. Kind of cool. Welcome Hello. To the bonfire, unkindled one. I'm a firekeeper. What up? I, I look like I'm poking her with a song, <laughs> stabbing her. The Lord, to this end, I'm very Can I level up? Do I? Must bow to her, apparently. Uh, so we've got vigor, attunement. Uh, so that's magic. Endurance is stamina. I'm probably gonna want to put a bit into that. Vitality. So I always thought vitality was health, but it's obviously equip load in this game, so that's different. Strength, dexterity. So what's the difference between strength and dexterity then, really? Okay, so dexterity puts up everything apart from left-handed weapon one, but it puts up fire magic. Okay, so strength seems something really cool. Intelligence, I'm, I'm dumb anyway. So that's magic more. Faith looks like it's more to do with mm, types of magic, and then luck is item pickup. So I'm probably going to be really basic here and do a little bit in vigor, a little bit in endurance, strength maybe. Maybe that. That, that looks kind of well balanced. See you then. Let's look upon my beautiful face one more time if I can. There, there, oh, there we go. This is the saviour of um, the Firelink Shrine right here. Start of a beautiful thing. Can I? Oh, I can. Here he is, the saviour. What a beautiful man. Uh, travel, I guess. High Wall of Lothric. Looks like that's where we're going.